viewed and viewed down at World Cup. We're off to the track walk. It's freezing cold at the top. And um, it's very muddy and wet, but we'll see what it's going to be like soon. It is, you can see it over there. It's dried up today. It's been a bit sunny this morning, but now it's clouds are coming back. And they're announcing rain tomorrow, all weekend, so... <laughs> Don't know. I haven't found any of my mates yet, so I'm on my own for now. Solo. I don't think I... I mean, the track is pretty simple, so I don't think I really need any dude next to me. So, we'll see if we catch up with someone on the way down, but I don't think we will. Look at the size of this runway. Airplanes land on this. That's so cool. <laughs> this is massive, literally. But yeah, that's a start. Let's see how it goes. There it is, the start. Looks all right now. If it doesn't rain all week, then it'll be really good. But it's gonna rain, I mean, it has to rain. I'm sure that it's gonna rain. It can't not rain, because it's just, that's what the weather says, but that looks, looks pretty sick. Got this. First little whoops, whoops hip section. Pretty cool. We'll have to see what we we'll have to do. <laughs> Straight through there. One little double hip, straight into a triple. It's pretty cool. Make mine reminds me of Diffy Bike Park, this track. It's like little rocks everywhere. Hard stand and dirt, but it's very muddy apparently, so. <laughs> we'll have to see. There it is. This is gonna be death if it rains. Oh no. This is gonna be really, really muddy and slippery if it rains a lot. <laughs> You'll probably just go sliding off that whole bit right there. Like a slide. It's first hopping up off. I don't know if they I don't know if they actually pull this whole thing or just do a hop on up off, I don't really know. You must have the speed to do it all, but I don't even know. I have to watch the the last year's GoPro POVs. It's pretty big to pull completely actually I think. <laughs> maybe maybe they do. I don't know. Loads of options. Oh, this is definitely has to pull. What? Is that enough speed? That's a massive pull if you want to go from there to there. That's a good 10 meters. 20 feet at least. 20 feet to really slippery grass. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe. Don't know. Big left and right. This is where the park, this is where it got, starts getting fast, I think. It comes here. This is, this is actually, like, this is really good grip right now. It ju just gonna, it's just gonna get so slippery if it rains. So it probably will have to. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely gonna rain, I think. You can't, can't break too much in this. I think you just have to hold on, just like I'm doing now. <laughs> Full speed down that. Straight down to this. Scary thing. You must, you have to, you have to, you go so fast down this. Literally, so fast.
knees are literally already hurting from walking down this and I'm not even at the, the, the steep bit yet. We're just at this really fast zone. But what to <laughs> open it's all right. It's gonna get so slippery after. Apparently you have to add, yeah, they told us to put the right appropriate shoes on. I'm just wearing the, the, the flat pedal Crank Brothers shoes. So we don't want to ruin the others. Well, yeah. If it doesn't rain, it's just primo conditions. Like builders would say. It's starting to get a little bit hot. I've got a jumper on and the helper jacket on. And it's getting hot. It's actually really cold at the top of the mountain, but hotter at the bottom. Because we've got an apartment at the top, so we're staying at the start, which is really cool. Still loads of chippy rocks. Really cool hip. Add some steez on in training. It's not too muddy. Then I think it's down here that there's this really sketchy motocross whoop section with the uh, slippy grass behind it. <laughs> right here we've got this bridge to flat. Full tokens needed. I just hope that we get some training in the dry like this because it'll be so good. It's just going to be so good if it stays a little bit. Because right now it's the best grip, but if it rains then it's horrifyingly slippy. Nice. Here it is, look, whoop section. Really fast. There's a sketchy mess. A couple riders pulled, it's a sketchy pull over there. Don't think it will happen in the wet though. It's pretty big. This is really cool, this. Mate, you do not want to slip on that part there in the rain. You just go straight down the hill, definitely. That looks so scary. Straight down the hill. Even is it up high or up low? What's the prediction? <laughs> hmm. I don't even know where it is here. Maybe. Maybe it's faster high and high over there. I don't even. I'm, I just look at the GoPro videos a bit. Get out. Can't figure out how they do it. I think that it might be faster by going high here and inside down there. Because going round, I mean, it does get you right, but the, the turn's all flat there. So maybe just going inside there might be a bit better. I guess. We'll have to try. All right, pull inside. And then there's, there's so many rocks like this the whole way down. Oh, I nearly just crashed there even. <laughs> nearly died. <laughs> it's so steep. Yeah, I'll have to stick to it. Stick to it. Dude, another helicopter. Right, this part is actually pretty steep. That is pretty steep. They go high, low. I think high is the best, really. Or maybe middle, high, through the middle. Oh. Yeah, I think high is good. And you set your right for that turn there that's gonna get destroyed. Man, if it rains, I'm gonna be like, before the race day, I'm gonna be like, I can't hit my protein. 20 whole eggs, 1,000 um, thingy majig calories, whatever, 200 grams of protein. And then I'm, I'm going to be ready to send it, see if that will work. I reckon low. That's what they did last year. Low the way. I definitely. Triple up over that. Man, it would have been so good if Kate Edwards was here. We would have done some laps. Really sick laps. Steezing it out everywhere. 
<laughs> it is, it is massive. There's hips everywhere, dude. Oh, this part is sick, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, they took the whoops out. What? There's no more whoops. Guess that doesn't matter. Oh, yeah. That scares me so much. This turn, if you go too fast. You don't want to like go out of it and hit one of those plastic protectors. That's what I was looking at in the GoPro. They're going so fast. Imagine hitting that when you come out of this turn. It would be crazy fast. Look at the brake bumps in it already and that we haven't even ridden yet. They took the whoops out of it. I mean, they're still there, but not really. Hmm. This is probably this must be slippery in the wet. Maybe not. I don't know. This doesn't look as steep on the GoPro videos. What? This is well steep. That's why the stoppies are so good on it. Look at the size of that drop. It's flat. Oh my God. That's why they put this part on, to go around it. What? Look at how, how big that drop is. No way. I think they just middle it down and go straight for it. But going high after that is probably so hard in the wet. Going high there is probably really hard. Where's the best option though? Otherwise you ride all the way down here. Oh. Massive. They are deaf. If you hit one of them by pressing down, then you, you're dead into the tree 100% dead in the tree maybe because you go you go out so fast doing this line we have to try and stick this line though because otherwise you'll end up down there then you have to pedal to get more speed to go straight down that so i think that definitely high is the best option but if if it's too slippy then it's going to be impossible even this part here to hold that little turn we'll have to see my foot is going to be deaf. Oh. oh my god, oh my god. Oh. What? Yeah. Dude. They all go high on this. No way. You have to stick the high in there. That in the mud is... How are we going to cross there in the mud? I have no idea. Here comes this part, they bunny up over this. Then smash that turn down there. What to do? Maybe inside is good, but I mean, full wide looks good too. I'm literally, I just don't, I don't rush in track walk. I just look at, I just run down it. Just look at everything and then try it tomorrow because I have no idea how it rides until I actually feel it. So I judge my lines in the actual riding process of it because Track walks are really important, so I have to do it so I don't die in a hole or something. But it's all on the bike that I judge it. Here it is. No way. See, there you go. This is not going to be possible to go out down there in the wet. <laughs> I'm not even going to film this walking down it because I'll slide in forever. 
How did they stay high? Mm -hmm. Even sticking it high in the dry is probably hard. One mistake. And that is a slip and slide the whole way down. Gonna be eating dirt. I can see it coming already, even I'm crashing off and down it. <laughs> this is where Jackson crashed. And Quali. On that. There. There's all the big tents down there. It's so common sound, massive. <clears throat> I think you just have to straightforward send it to me when it's like this. <laughs> so, so this looks very sketchy. This is this is like the kind of the kind of bike stuff where if you're locked in, you get through. But if you're not locked in, you do one balance mistake, then you're off the track in the bushes down there, a hundred percent. Oh. Even falling over. That's even been crashed on already. Not even on the bike. I don't recognise this part of the track. <laughs> Pretty impressive part of the track. First part, flat. It's flat. Oh, now I recognise it. There we go. Oh yeah, this is this part. Whoa. Oh yeah. What? This looks real sketchy too. I think I'm gonna stick to the high here. And then like pull onto the bottom line. Just pull a little drop because high is way too sketchy for me, I think. <laughs> there. Mm, tasty. This is a condor jump. I have to send a condor on this. Easy. We'll get it done. For fun. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the fella crashed. <laughs> Still fast. <laughs> rocks again. Slippery rocks. <laughs> oh yeah, this is so deaf. This part. If you, if you, it's literally the, the sketchiest parts of the tracker. It's just where there's tiny little rocks that can just chuck you into a tree, and then you just die into the tree and and say, oh, what did I do? I crashed. Here's the jump section. Got to be careful, this one goes so deep easily. Could get so deep so easily. If you go too fast. Don't want to go too fast on this. It's a little road gap. It's not a big deal. Oh yeah. That's sick though. The wall ride. Is that? No. Maybe they open that if it's way too wet. Why is that there? Maybe it's where it's, it's way too wet, I don't know. Hmm. Here comes the sketchy, skinny and tight tree pull. It's actually a big drop to be fair. <laughs> Straight down there. Oh, right down there. Good job. This is so steep. Uh, hmm. Oh, wait, there's a black line. No, that's not. That's only for the cameras, though. You can't hold that. Oh, she's... This is so steep to go down my foot. Whoa. Oh, my God. Whoa. Okay. All right, last bit. There's the finish. <coughs> so 
We used to go under there. This is this is this is steep drop though. <laughs> Imagine pulling from here to down there in front of the turn. You would just die and be dead. Hundred percent. <sighs> really cool. There's a hip, that's gonna be six jump if it's not too wet. Be really cool. I think that I'm gonna stop and look at this on the first one. Cause it's not the size that worries me, it's this. How soft the turns are. Look at how soft the turn is. It's so soft. That's gonna be a massive rut, definitely. Look at the mud there. Cause you don't wanna extra massively case this. Sorry about it. So this massive turn. This is huge actually. There it is, the finish. So there it is. Track walk done. The UCI down at World Cup with Ludenville. See you tomorrow for the trainings. I have no idea how that's gonna be.